I tested every feature of Notebook LM and I found something shocking. Three features give you 95% of all the value. Most people spend hours using other features. In this video, I will show exactly which three features to master so that you can transform the way you use AI overnight. And the best part is this tool is completely free. Now this first notebook LM feature has supercharged my productivity. And it's not what people think. It's not about AI chat. It's not about summarization. It's not a flashy feature. Matter of fact, the key difference between notebook LM and a traditional chatbot is that notebook LM is grounded in sources, not just any source, sources that you give it. That's PDFs, that's Google slides, that's YouTube videos, that's articles, etc. You feed the language model your specific specific sources. Now here's the issue. Most people will dump all of their information to Notebook LM. Every document, every PDF, every YouTube video. And what does this create? Information chaos. And I have made this mistake before. Notebook LM can take up to 50 sources, 25 million words. That is a lot of information going into a large language model. But if you mindlessly dump all of this information into the sources, it will be a waste of all the power of Notebook LM. You have to have a strategy. Here's my exact process. I start with a core question. The core question could be, give me five steps to starting a business. Then I will go to discover sources in Notebook LM and I will have it go out to the internet to find super specific source. Part two, then I add all the sources that I already found, whether it be notes, PDFs, other types of documents, YouTube videos, etc. Now I have specifically qualified all of the resources and I know that I will have a high quality output of all of my AI research. So this is the sources feature on Notebook LM, but I call this process strategic source management, focusing on specific and detailed high quality sources so that you can get the best high quality outcomes for your AI research. And this will save you tens of hours, potentially days or even weeks of research on your own. Feature number two, this was created by a new breakthrough in technology. This new feature takes all the AI research that you're putting into Notebook LM and it lets you transform that research into a podcast-like style conversation. All of the 50 sources, the 25 million words that gets put into specific information that you can chat with to have summaries can also now be put into your own personalized podcast. During this podcast, there will be two AI voices who are doing specific deep dives, calling out themes and helping you uncover and digest very dense information all while you passively just listen. Let's jump right into the deep dive today. We're doing something a little uh, different. Yeah. What do we got? We're looking at the strategy behind some content, specifically notes and plans from a creator, Brandon Bryant. Oh, interesting. Yeah. He's planning videos about Notebook LM, you know, that AI tool for research and notes. Right. Notebook LM. So we're seeing his raw planning. Like This feature lets you have a deep dive on all of your AI research and actually have a conversation almost like you're talking to a specifically smart colleague who is breaking down something that's very dense and hard to understand. And Notebook LM just added a new upgrade where you can now do this podcast-like conversation in over 50 plus languages. Now this feature is called the audio overview. It lets you take all of that AI research, all the 25 million words, 50 resources and creates essentially a podcast breakdown that's roughly 15 to 20 minutes. But that's not even the best part. The best part is that while you're listening to the podcast, if you have a conversation, you can actually ask the two AI podcasters a question and they will answer you. It's an entirely interactive experience that has never existed before. Now, this last feature has saved me the most time 
of any AI tool. And this is a bonus feature because it has four formats that work in one feature. Now this first format is all about condensing all of that information, all 25 million possible words into very distilled and understandable summaries. You can focus on tone, you can focus on format, you can focus on depth, and you can really help curate all of these summaries and information specifically for presentations. Anytime you have to present to your team, you might have to present to your company, or you might be just in a pitch opportunity to investors. This format is called the briefing doc. It essentially synthesizes all the large sets of information, puts it into a brief, it adapts to your audience, it figures out the format and tone, and it goes into depth on all the specific places that you want it to go. It also can surface things that you might not have found if you were doing manual research, and it most likely saves you a ton of time all in one place, specifically ready for a presentation. Format number two. Most people use AI specifically for research, AKA answers. Now the other way you can use AI is to come up with questions to ask. So if you're putting in all these sources, all this research, there has to be specific questions to get deeper understanding. This feature helps you to ask the right follow-up questions. It also helps you to follow and dive deeper into the citations of all your sources and it helps you to have discussion questions that you can have live with teammates or with experts, etc. It really creates this awesome learning experience that guides you and helps you have a deeper level of understanding of all the material that you're putting into the language model. This feature is the FAQ. It anticipates smart questions from all your content. It gives you grounded and accurate fast answers. It creates a conversational entry point to very complex information and material. And lastly, it can save time while boosting clarity, learning, and collaboration. Format three transforms all your information into a personalized learning system. It gives you key concepts, questions, definitions, and summaries. This format guides you in a logical sequence through all the information, helps you understand the big picture, but also understand the small details. This format is the study guide format. It extracts the most important takeaways from any doc. It structures them with clarity, retention, and active learning. It adapts to your purpose, whether you are teaching, prepping, or studying, and it turns passive reading into intentional and effective knowledge building. And format number four automatically transforms all the events, milestones, and changes over time of any of your AI research and puts it in chronological order. Putting large swaths of information in chronological order is one of the best ways for humans to retain information and it's going to help you see any big patterns and you'll be able to dive right into those with the click of a button. This format is called timeline. You can use it in so many different ways. You could use it if you're tracking the founding or the funding milestones of a startup. You could visualize scientific discoveries or policy rollouts. You could lay out event sequences of legal cases or medical cases. And you can build a study timeline for any exams or any historical analysis. You don't have to master every feature that Notebook LM offers. Focus on these three features and you will get better results than 90 plus percent of all other users. If you found value from this video, make sure to check out my recent video that shows you how to create the perfect AI prompt.